The state television company Western Armenia represents the most important news for today, today's broadcast. On the occasion of the 14th anniversary of the government of Western Armenia, press secretary report. News from Javakh. The Red Crescents are followers of the Baku regime. Rasmum Gembak. We in our place names. Armenian national cloth is a reflection of our national thinking. Guhar Torusa. Ambert is on the short list of seven most endangered monuments in Europe in 2024. On the occasion of the 14th anniversary of the government of Western Armenia, for the final settlement of the Armenian issue, the settlement of two parallel issues are assumed. Those are, first, condemnation of the genocide committed against Armenia. The second is the issue of the eliminating the consequences of the genocide committed against Armenian people, means compensation of damages. However, in fact, both issues have been settled, but the genocide has been condemned. The material and the territory decisions related to compensation for the damages of the genocide have been made, have been established, but not implemented. The genocide was condemned twice, first on May 24, 1951, when the countries of the triple alliance states France, Great Britain and Russia condemned Turkey's new crimes against humanity and civilization in a joint statement and noted that those crimes will have consequences. And it happened so. The Military Special Court of Constantinople in 1919 carried out a trial against the young Turk parliamentaries on the following charges for drawing the Ottoman Empire into war and organizing the mass massacres and the portion of the Armenian citizens in, in the empire. The Special Military Court issued relevant verdicts, including the death sentence to the main organizers of the genocide in Abstania. Decisions relate to the elimination of the consequences of the genocide have also been made. The compensation for material damages was made and presented by Special Commission. In 1919, and on the issue of territorial compensation, the Treaty of Sivers was signed and the arbitral award was ratified by the 28th President of the USA, Woodrow Wilson. The above-mentioned decisions are referred to 1995 up to 1918, to the committed crimes from which 1894 and were excluded. The crimes committed by the Turkish government against the Armenians and other damages inflicted on the Armenians and on the other hand, the Wilsonian Arbitral Award covers only the four villages of the Western Armenia. But nevertheless, it turns out that we are trying to the previous way again and we put the issue of condemning the genocide on the agenda, immediately connecting to the issue of eliminating the consequences of ge the genocide. Armenian government, the press secretary of the Western Armenian government, when reading the declaration of the National Council of Western Armenia, emphasized that the National Council of Western Armenia is the only leadership among Armenians around the world that adopts a new direction in legal and strategic terms to realize the supreme goal of the Armenians. The new direction is the campus on the basis of which the status of the Armenians of Western Armenia is determined by today's weak situation. The speech of the press secretary of the Armenian government is available on the YouTube page of Western Armenian TV. Inspection of Javakh municipality took place as a result of the inspection. The efficiencies were found in various areas, including those related to the quality of water supply. The state audit report contains a separate dam on the prevision of utility service, which is specifically states. The municipality has a problem with water supply to the population. Drinking water is supplied to the part of the population in a non-centralized way, and the supplied water is not purified. Therefore, the activity of the municipality in the direction of ensuring the quality of water supply and drinking water to the population is not sufficient, stated the conclusion. An exhibition of cartoons took place in Javakh in the Key of Time animation studio. Mader Maidan, one of the teachers of the studio, presented the history of the studio's creation and talked about the children's work. And the children themselves presented their works in two languages, Georgian and Armenian, and briefly introduced themselves to the audience. Six animations were shown to the audience. The first, San Marta, Melikidze. The second, Christmas in Ahal Kalaki by Tamar Kasrashvili. The third was Brothers by Lon Melikidze. The four, Sela V by Nino Melikidze. And the five, Christmas Eve by Tamar Melikidze. And the sixth one, Lalabi Majorester. Unfortunately, the Azerbaijan Red Crescents are followers of the regime wearing clothes protected by the Geneva Convention. 
Swedish journalist Rasmum Kambek wrote in his X micro blog responding to the information that representatives of the Azerbaijan Red Crescent visited Armenians in Nagorno Karabakh. The management board of the organization is closely connected with the leadership of Azerbaijan. At one time, they were used for a protest on the road of Agdam near the entrance to Nagorno Karabakh. Instead of making statements at the request of the ICRS, they deliberately made counter statements against the ICRC, which deepened the humanitarian crisis, he wrote. Western Armenia TV present the Turkish principles of renaming historical name of Harbert in the stories of we and our place names. The city of Harbert, located on the left bank of Artsan, eastern Euphrates River, northwest of Tsovk Lake, was formerly part of the Asit Hanzid province of the Great Armenian Tsovk world. The region of the name Harbert is connected with the name of the village of Har, located in the territory of Harbert in ancient times, to which the word fortress was later added with the construction of the city fortress and called Harbert. Har is etymologically translated as road in Hurrian language, so Harbert means fortress on the road. Historian Meher Hovanishan stated as follows. Har is an old word meaning a road and a um, fort was built on the road as a shelter. According to some people, Har means a road in an ancient language and the place was called the Fort of the Road. It is un understandable because the transit highway, the Royal Road, built by Darius I of Persia in Central Asia passed through the Harbert province and the Harbert plain. The Turks changed the name Harbert from early times to Harput. The rocky terrain and the waterless climate conditions of the city of Harbert did not satisfy the local Armenians and some of them in 1670 moved to the suburban plain southwest of Harbert and founded a new city and named it New Harbert. The rocky terrain and the waterless climate conditions of the city of Harbert did not satisfy the local Armenians and some of them in 1670 moved to the suburb plain southwest of Harbert and founded a new city and named it New Harbert. The fourth part of the stories we and our place names is available on the website of Western Armenia TV. Within the cooperation with Western Armenia TV, journalist Gohar Torosan provided our editorial office with several photos from her personal archive that characterize Armenian girl and Armenian identity. According to Torosan, the national costume, the Armenian costume, is a reflection of our mentality of our people. It has not only expressed our identity, but has also been one of the forces that maintain that identity, having a centuries-old history and being as rich as and diverse as our polyglot languages. Due to certain historical circumstances, two costume complexes were formed, Western Armenian and Eastern Armenian. Umbert Historical and Cultural Reserve has been shortlisted in the seven most endangered list of the program as one of the 11 most endangered heritage sites in Europe. Europa Nostra, the European voice of the civil society dedicated to the culture and natural heritage and European Investment Bank. Institute having announced that in Europe and in 2024, names of monuments and heritage sites included in the seven most endangered program. Executive President of Europa Nostra, Dr. Prof. Herman Parzinger, stated that selected heritage sites are at risk to demolition, inappropriate development, the divesting impact of natural disasters due to neglect or lack of funding. By publishing this shortlist, we want to send a message of support to the activities, activists and local communities who are deeply committed to the saving these places. Europe's heritage must be preserved not only as a testament to our shared past, but also as a catalyst for a stable, united and peaceful future. According to Shiva Dustada, Dean of the European Investment Bank Institute, cultural heritage is a key resource for European identity, attractiveness and economic growth. This was all for today. Goodbye. <laughs> Mes porcel en jengel, meng stercel en spurk, cheng toch nigger gan vipat mutsun an gut. Armenia, arachine tu es motetzel hachin, minchai sorun es erosner, u el voch mi lucin, chichizachi, pinde cosa man, yesem copa spane. Armenia, kes carutzel en havatof sor. Tu verás un velas como Hrit, un velas luz.